Hi guys, next question is question number 19. In the movement of fluids and dissolved molecules, diffusion is proportional to the permeability of the membrane. A non-diffusible anion will slow transfer of a diffusible cation. The transmembrane potential depends upon the presence of non-diffusible ions. The osmotic pressure is necessary to prevent ionic migration and filtration is hydrostatic pressure dependent. So let's go with every of these options and see which one is true or false. Diffusion is proportional to the permeability of the membrane. Permeability of the membrane. So we know many types of membranes like permeable, semi-permeable and unpermeable which do not permit uh, transfer or passing of the molecules or any of the particles. So it depends on the pores or pumps of the uh, membrane, uh, which one are small or huge and permit passage. Of course, it is proportional, a large gate, a large entrance of the particles. So uh, option one is true. A non-diffusible uh, anion will slow transfer of a diffusible cation. So, uh, for example, if we have many particles and they are mixed in one solvent, for example, you see uh, green and blue particles. And of course, if this one is a gate and they compete for passing, uh, if this gate permit only one particle for going to and another particle is not diffusible through this gate, it will cover and of course will, will block the passage. So the option two is correct. The transmembrane potential depends upon the presence of uh, non-diffusible ions. As you know, uh, ions that do not pass uh, through the membrane uh, saves a potential gradient. And of course, water will come back. You know that permeability and, uh, and membrane and especially osmosis is important to know that uh, it is regulable by, by, uh, sorry, by sodium and water. Where is sodium higher, water will go to this gradient. The osmotic pressure is necessary to prevent ionic migration. It's not correct that ions mean not only sodium, but also chloride, magnesium, uh, gallium, potassium, and uh, calcium and many others. So osmosis, osmotic pressure is uh, is not ob obligatory or ne necessary for preventing uh, all the ionic migration. It is false. And option number five, filtration is hydrostatic pressure dependent. Of course, as uh, you know, one of the example uh, of great example will be uh, renal glomeruli where uh, occurs uh, filtration and secretion of the urine. So I have many effects uh, attached here like Starling hypothesis which uh, states that the movement of fluid uh, due to filtration across the wall of a capillary is dependent um, on the balance between the hydrostatic and anchotic pressures. Uh, they are called the uh, Starling forces. Also many facts that the diffusible ions are sodium, potassium, chloride, but not calcium. And they tend to move across the cell membrane according to their concentration gradient. Uh, difference uh, in the concentration of ions on opposite side of a cellular membrane, membrane lead to a voltage uh, called the membrane potential. So it's a startling hypothesis. Thank you for your watching. And if you like this, you can sub subscribe and follow me. Any suggestion, any message from you, it's a good thing. Thank you very much and have a great time.